Ladies and gentlemen, once again welcome back to our channel and the topic for today's COBOL tutorial is COBOL basic perform statement and in this session we will primarily focus on what are the different kinds of perform statements and how you can use these perform statement in your COBOL program. So without wasting any time let's focus on today's agenda. So we start today's session with introduction to COBOL perform statement after that, I will talk about inline and outline COBOL perform statement. Then we will deep dive into different variants of COBOL perform statement. And finally, we will look at the basic variant of COBOL perform statement and how exactly you can use this statement in your COBOL program as per your requirement. So ladies and gentlemen, before I start with today's presentation, I would request you all to do subscribe to our channel because we need your support to grow our channel. And in case if you have already subscribed to our channel, then I would like to say a big thank you for your subscription. So let's get started. COBOL programs are generally made up of three logical structure. First one is sequence, second one is selection, and third one is iteration. In layman term, COBOL perform statement is used to transfer control explicitly or implicitly within the paragraph, section or in the procedure. The perform statement in COBOL is divided into two different categories. First one is inline perform statement and the second one is outline perform statement. And the major difference between inline and outline perform statement is that inline perform statement mainly execute the piece of logic or set of statement between the perform and and perform statement. And the example of inline perform is perform until statement. However, the outline perform statement is mainly used to perform a set of statement or a piece of logic which is included in a separate paragraph or a section. And the example for outline perform statement is a normal perform statement where you just use perform keyword followed by a paragraph name or a section name. Now let's look at the different variants of perform statement in COBOL. So there are four different formats of COBOL perform statement and you can use either of the format in your COBOL program as per your requirement. So the first variant is perform followed by a paragraph name. The second format is perform with times phrase and the third format is perform with until phrase and the last format is perform with varying phrase. Now let's focus on the basic variant of COBOL perform statement and in next section we will look at how exactly control flow whenever you use perform statement in your COBOL program. So here's a sample COBOL program which is actually calculating tax on employee salary. And if you look at the procedure division, there's a paragraph called a triple zero hyphen main hyphen logic. And I've used two perform statement. First one is a basic perform statement and then I've used perform with through option. So when the first perform statement is executed, so the control will go to the paragraph that is b triple zero hyphen calc hyphen text and it will start executing all the statements which is mentioned in that particular paragraph. Once all the statement is executed in that particular paragraph, then control will again go back to the same uh, paragraph that is a triple zero hyphen main hyphen logic and it will start execution from the second statement that is display statement. And remember, in case if you have used go to statement in paragraph b triple zero hyphen calc hyphen text, then control will not going to return to the calling paragraph. In fact, it will go to the paragraph that you have specified in your go to statement. Apart from that, in case if you have used perform statement in b triple zero hyphen calc hyphen text, then control will go to the paragraph that you have specified with the perform statement. And after executing all the statements in that particular paragraph, control will again return back to the main calling paragraph that is a triple zero hyphen main hyphen logic. And the next imperative statement that it will going to execute is display statement. Now let's move on to the next section where we'll look at a sample COBOL program and how exactly I've used the perform statement in that COBOL program. So in this example, 
I have used two perform statement. First one is to execute a paragraph B triple zero hyphen calc hyphen tax. And the second perform statement is to execute a series of paragraphs starting from C010 hyphen calc hyphen salary through C099 hyphen exit. For clear understanding, I have highlighted uh, the first statement with red color and second statement with green color so that you can easily understand what are the series of paragraph or what is an individual paragraph that particular statement will going to execute. So ladies and gentlemen, this marks an end to our today's presentation and I would request you all to do subscribe to our channel because we need your support to grow our channel. And in case if you have any feedback or question, then do mention that in comment section and I'll going to respond back after this presentation. Thank you so much.